firefighters have been fighting several fires, all of which they set themselves. As part of a training exercise for new recruits, Trevor Alt joins us live from the scene. Trevor, what's happening? Well, Ken and Jenny, we have seen a active fire that's happening right now. These flames just picked up in the past couple minutes or so. And as you mentioned, this is by design. There's been various fires inside this house on Northeast 30th and Hillsborough for about three hours or so. And now firefighters, you could say, are fighting it defensively in that they're just letting this house burn itself out. The property owners here bought this in the past year or so. They're going to be building some duplexes on the property and they want to get rid of this house. But instead of just knocking it down, they figure they might as well let the fire department get some use out of it. And that is exactly what they've done this morning. I appreciate these guys, what they do every day. It's not often people enjoy seeing a neighboring house set on fire, but that's the case Tuesday for Ike Meggs. They were practicing for the last couple of weeks, and it's a good way for rookies to, to see what yeah, I mean, life's going to be like. He's referring to the new Hillsborough Fire Department recruits who are getting some live firefighting experience across the street from Ike's house. This house was donated to us for the purpose of destroying it, burning it down. While the house is vacant, the department filled it with pallets and bales of hay, which they then set on fire. We have eight new fire recruits, and so this is an opportunity for them to get inside and fight, do some real firefighting. The goal is to squeeze as much training out of the house as possible. They had eight different locations inside ready to burn, but they're also monitoring the house's structural stability. And as soon as it starts to waver, that's when the internal training stops. If there's any sign that it's getting that direction, they'll pull them out. But we're pretty good about making sure that we don't let it feel too hot before they're able to, before they move forward and put it down. And it's pretty clear looking at the house now that they have reached that stage, although I can tell you they made it through all eight of the different checkpoints inside the house. They're really quite pleased at how well this house did hold up while they did all of these training exercises. And now all that they have to worry about is making sure that they're containing this fire to just this one little property and not spreading around. All of the neighbors have been aware that this is going to be happening for weeks now, so there shouldn't be too much of a problem. They're making sure they get some food, but so far, a great training exercise for the Hillsborough Fire Department. Reporting live this afternoon, Trevor Alt, Coin 6 News. Yeah. All that training.